Oh, is it the one that just plays with me? Teases me. Ah, I have a battery. I have one battery. Make it last. Ah, oh, that's much brighter. Much better. Make it last. Don't waste it. What's down here? Death. Please be open. Oh, this door needs a key. <sighs> Why? Find the key to access the mail ward. Ay ay ay. Kick it kick it through. Do something. It's a gymnasium. What I shall do is I shall play until I either die again or I finish the game. Whichever comes first. I think that seems like a reasonable thing to do. Just we've been going for an hour now, and I was about now fifty-six minutes apparently. I just need a breather. You know, all this horror, all this running around, all this stress is. You know, it's uh, very tiring. Oh, for God's sake! Now where am I going? Uh, I'm lost. Oh no, not I'm not lost. I have found a vent. There we go. Oh my god. And now we are in the gymnasium. Uh, what, the? what the hell? Bluebeard's wives. Bodies hanging like wet laundry, like skinned rabbits. Men mutilated, hunted and murdered. The shortest distance between any two points separates violence and ruined lust. Whatever story he's telling himself, he's not making women to bear his children, he's making women to kill them. Lisa, I want you to burn this place and any evidence it, evidence it ever existed to the ground. Destroy the Murkoff Corporation. Bury it in shame. Take away his money. Wipe it from history. This man thinks he's in love. He thinks the therapy made him better. Everything reeks of death and fear. Piss and coppery blood. Meat decomposing to game. Ooh. My goodness me. He's not going to come back, is he? A note or something? When I was a boy, my mother no way. get married. <laughs> oh. I thought he'd left me. I thought he'd left. I thought he just wasn't going to allow me to get away. <sighs> Too easy, eh? Too easy. It's quite a big area, this. So there's lots of places to run and hide. All I need is a key. Just need a key. Although if I find the key, I don't know where the door is that I need to put it in. What's my bearings here?
here's the ceremony area. Oh, key. No, we're off again. We're off again, boys and girls. We're off again. Although this time I won't die. I will not die. Where am I? Hey, I'm hobbling along again. This time. Uh, the dead end room. Oh man. And I have to find the door with the with the key, the exit door with the key. He's out there, he's out there, he's out there. Is he coming in? Jim. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. This looks about right to me. Back into the kitchen. Back out the door. Where was the exit door? Come on, come on. We're almost there, no need to panic. Here we go, here we go. Yes. No! One more. I try, and I try. You all betray me. You can hang, like the rest of them. Someone else going you on the honeymoon. I hate to imagine our yeah. anniversary. Hold still. God damn it, what are you? Damn it, darling! Learning his behavior! What happened? What happened? We could have been beautiful. Oh. <sighs> ah. Let's watch him die. Bastard. Right, should we try again? To get the hell out!
Is anybody else going to try and stop us now? Any of the freak shows? Oh. God, I feel, I feel drained, don't I? I'd hate to be in his shoes. Don't know I'm still going. I'm just sitting in a chair and I'm knackered. Male ward. Is that the way out? Doors are here. Oh! The church is burning. Who put the, who set the church on fire? Bloody blasphemy here. I've seen more than enough dick and balls tonight to last me a lifetime. Not all of them attached to a man. Let's wrap this up and get back to the truck. Serve and protect. Corporate cops, mercenaries, private military contractors, whatever they call them now. They're all they're as helpless as the rest of us. Need to get out. Escape. I'm trying. I'm trying my best. Come on. I've got time to waste here. As we get deadly force. Kill anything that moves. That'll probably include me as well, will it? Come on. Come on, we need to move, we need to move quickly. Dear sirs, from Helen Grant. The groundwork has been laid to ensure an uninventful egress for Rudolf Wernicke from structural and financial systems at Mount Massive. His advanced age should alleviate any suspicions among contractors and employees, among whom he has been cheerfully nicknamed the Crypt Keeper. And legally speaking, he died years ago. I understand patients blah de blah de blah and blah de blah have already been scheduled for transit. We're all terribly excited at the obvious profit potential of the new project. My researchers have combed through Wernicke's files and found no mention of the three lucid dreamers. I think we can safely assume Wernicke and, uh, was sufficiently distracted by the partial success of patient Billy Hope, along with his own infirmity, to be ignorant of the real discovery at hand. Even minimal exploitation of these resources is hard to overestimate. I only hope the new facility is sufficiently shielded to allow female staff so I can see what comes with my own eyes. Respectfully, Helen Grant. Okay, so we're still trying to get to the exit. This time now we're going to be hunted by not freak shows, but by people with big guns. Just when you think four things couldn't get any worse. As per usual, they bloody well did! Keep low, keep low and move. Keep low and keep moving. Let's stop. be wrong for those officers. The church is on fire! <laughs> Where's God when you need him? I knew the church was. We saw the church before. Are you blind? Obviously he's a bit mad, you know. He's gone through a lot. We'll forgive him. Casting a very nice orangey glow, though. Don't jump up and scare me. Look, they're dead. They're properly dead.
Wait a minute, this is this where we were in... No, I don't think so. In the original game? Three blind dreamers. Level triple black. Security protocols, including chemical restraint, physical restraint, and separate adaptive hyperbaric chambers are to be used at all time in transit. Chemical stimulation is highly recommended for all personnel within 500 meters of the patients. Attempts at communication should be assumed to be hallucinations and disregarded. Facial disfigurement should not be taken as a sign of lost acuity. They are physically blind but not unseeing. Where was I going now? I've lost my bear rings. I think it's down this way. Library. All right, it's down here. Recreation hall. Nope. So we're going to have to go through this way. It looks like. Yeah, I think this is the area from the uh, uh, from the first game. And we uh, yeah, because we went. Yeah, it's all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It is. Go downstairs actually. Looks like going downstairs is the only way to go. And then there's the doors. The doors are there. so close. We were so close. Don't die on me now, Mr. Park. Ugh, get me out. The orange glow is not the, the fire of the church, it's sunrise. Freedom! Mount Massive Asylum, eh? Up yours! I don't know where I'm going, I'm just assuming this is the right way to go. A, a jeep? So handily placed for me to jump in and drive off.
No, come on. That's it, that's it, let's go, let's go. And we're out of there, I think. You press that button. There's no going back, Mr. Park. There's enough hard evidence in that video file to make a world of shit for our friends at Murkoff. You got out of Mount Massive alive, and we've done everything in our power to cover your tracks. But our enemies are twitching and malicious corporate paranoiacs with resources you're too moral to imagine. You won't be the only target. Anyone you care about, your wife, your child, there'll be nothing to Murkoff but ways to hurt you. I need you to understand the bridge you're crossing here. You will do irrevocable damage to the company. You might even get close to something like justice. But once you click upload, your life is over. Everyone you love is fucked. But it's the right thing to do. Is hurting Murkoff worth that much to you? Do I have to make the choice? So that appears to be the end of uh, Outlast, the Whistleblower DLC, and I, yes, as I said, it was fun. It was fun, and at the end there, Park, after all he'd been through, took the risk. He had to take Murkoff down. So that was the Halloween special, obviously it's not Halloween anymore, but yes. Uh, I'm glad I did it. It was uh, a very enjoyable game and uh, a nice way to finish the Outlast uh, series. Filled in a few gaps and, uh, and carried on the story quite nicely. So uh, anyway, hope you enjoyed uh, the frights, the scares with me, the, the, the terror, the panic. And, uh, and as always, join me next time for whatever it may be. So uh, see you soon.